Hi guys, my name is Firefly and welcome back to a brand new episode of Timberborn where we are using Iron Thief on hard mode on a thousand islands. Now, if you watched the last episode, we tried twice and we failed. Um, this is the third try and this colony is called Die Hardest because this is the one we're going to be winning on. Now, I have made loads and loads of carrots this time. I am not messing around with carrots. I've got two farmers. They're not even farming in time. We're on our second drought. So what happened? We had a first drought. Um, I, I missed, I skipped through that because I've seen it twice in the last episode. And straight away, we have a second drought. And I think that's pre-programmed into hard mode. You instantly get another drought. So this barely had time to grow and farm, be farmed before it was drying out again. I've started building this little area here to try and preserve the water, but it doesn't do that. <laughs> it doesn't do that at all. Um, the water flow is weird. It goes this way now. Now that I've got this here, it goes this way. So I'm going to need to put a lot of uh, levees, yeah, levees on here to try and redirect that water this way. Now I'm thinking, I'm thinking guys, that's going to take a lot of wood. That is going to take a lot of wood. We need to get the forester up and running because we are running out of wood here. And we need to get a bit of power up and running. So I've got some research. I've already unlocked. What have I unlocked? I unlocked levies, which is 120 research. We are now going to be doing the forester which we need planks. So we need to take a look at that. We need to take a look at planking up this place. That's a decent location for a forest, to be honest. And we need to start getting a load of wood ready. I've got two incubators going, incubators, because they will start, yeah, look, dying of old age. And we need to make sure we've got people to be replaced. I've got no berries, but that should grow pretty soon. And once we get a forester, we can plant berries. All right, let's get a lumber mill going. I'm literally just going to do this. I'm not going to use water because this district is just going to be for food and water. This is just to survive. Then we're going to move on to other districts and make it a lot easier. Um, ah, it's because... It's too long. That's okay. We can do it like that. We can do it like that. Yeah, that looks okay. So, I don't even have enough unemployed people to do this. I could stop the lumberjack flags because there's not many more lumberjack flags that I'm getting. Or oh, <laughs> lumberjack flags. There's not many more trees that I'm getting. Um, I need to be able to get them ones over there. Okay, they will get them. And have I set them to be cut? I have. Let's set these to be cut as well. And literally, this is the last set of trees I've got. So I've got to make sure I can get that forest up, up and running. Otherwise, we just won't have enough trees. We won't have enough trees and we won't be able to survive. There's always a challenge. Always a challenge. I like it. I like it a lot. All right. So hopefully... Now we've never ever made it past the first drought, no second drought, sorry. So hopefully the next drought is not as long or it doesn't come as quick. That's what I'm worried about, it coming too quick. I need to harvest some food. I've got a decent amount of storage. I need berries to come back so we can start depopulating. And yeah, that should be fine. Once, once we get that up and running, we shouldn't be too bad. In fact, in fact, let's put some more carrots down because I want to make sure I definitely always have enough food. We're going to fill this place with berries because we need that for reproduction. And we're going to need maybe one more water area so we can bung that there. Now I might not put that into service until we have more people. Drought is ended. That's good. 
Now, because I've put this here, water doesn't actually make it here for some reason. I don't know how that is working. So water comes from down here, yeah. That's fine, and here. It comes round, and it comes into this little bit. But it doesn't fill up enough to come here. Now, I think at some point I'm going to have to block this off. So it comes here and it fills up this area. So we've got water coming in, lovely. How many logs we got? We've got a decent amount of logs. Oh, that takes a lot of logs. You know what? This is going to be on hold. Oh, that's, yeah, that's going to be on hold. We need to make planks. I need to pause that. I wonder if that stops them from actually doing the thing. They see here, the water's not coming. Now, I'm guessing the water only comes because it flows through here. Oh, where's that coming from? Oh, that's coming from around there. Okay. So if we do this, we can actually see how the water's flowing. The water's flowing through here. So if I block off this area, it will start flowing through here, right? What's up here? Oh, it might flow through there. But some will come through here. We got a waterfall there. If I block off that area, it will come down here. I need to get water in here. Ah, I need to get water in there. Okay, let's slow this down a bit because we're not getting water. That's a waste. So this is practically doing nothing. Let's delete that. Okay, that got deleted. We'll have to deal with that at some other point. We'll just have to try and fight through all the, all the droughts for now. Alright, and now I want to reduce you. I want to get rid of you. There's no berries at the moment. That's bad. So where did that employee go? Maybe they just haven't... I can't reduce that. Okay, he went there. I've got no one for there. So if I pause that for now, yeah, I've got some for there. Okay, let's make planks because we need seven planks. Definitely. Uh, can we? Uh, excuse me. Oh, I need to do the thing first. Right, that's letting that through. We can start finally getting that done. Maybe I'll destroy this one as well, just to let the flow go a little bit more. Yeah, okay. So we need to redirect it. So I'm guessing, actually, I'd like to put one here, to be honest, so we can redirect it this way. That is important. Now, hopefully, forecast unknown, hopefully we don't get another drought for a while. Put this as high, because that's very important. I've got six planks in there already. Amazing. Amazing stuff. All right, let's build that up and get a forest running. All right, so we've got this up and running. I've paused this production because until I get wood, that's not even an, that's not even a thing on my list. Right, so what do I want to plant first? Most likely, I want to plant crops or trees that go grow really fast because I have no idea when the next drought is going to be. So I can replace it once we start getting a, a stock of wood. But until then, we need to make sure we have wood. All right, these will need to be killed or taken out. And I need to plant more berries. Let's uh, get the berries up and running. 
let's just like literally plant as many as we possibly can. We want a stock of that. We could actually get rid of this now. Because I don't think they're going to regrow. And we can, most, we can use this area for something else. Alright. Alright, that is looking pretty decent. Let's get this good in. So if you do pause it, it actually stops all production towards it, which is really good. Um, I've got one person building. Got my forester. Prioritize birch. We can get the blueberries in a bit. You know what? I think we may have got a drought again. How long? Have... <laughs> I was just going to say, I think we've actually got a stable colony. Okay, they should come. Like, the droughts are absolutely crazy. All right, we need to start researching stuff so we can start uh, getting water around here. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, so we need one of these bad boys. We need both of these, actually. Why are these halted? They don't have blueberries. That's fine. We've got blueberries coming in. Um... We'll get this one first, yes. And then we need a bit, oops, no. We need a bit more research to get the other one. So, we're gonna build a pathway along here. Now, levees can go on top of each other. So, how far are we going up here? Might as well be to here. Like that. I want to hit this bit. Am I seeing that right? Okay, cool. Because I might want to open it up at some point. So it will be... Some, this is going to take a lot of wood. But at least we now have wood coming in. So it will be something like this. Let's just do that. Um, let's build pathways here, like that, like that, and that can go long there. We need to get rid of that tree, but that's fine. Let's just delete that tree. It's not going to do us any harm deleting one tree. All right. So this is quite important, but we need more children. Yeah, there we go. We got it. We're getting children good. We've got food. We've got water. Now, depending, depending on how long this drought is, will depend on how difficult this next one's going to be. Now, we don't need a... Do we need the forester just yet? Yeah, why not? How much have we got? 37 wood. It would be nice if we had more unemployed. I need two more unemployed. I need to get this plank thing working. The plank, the lumber mill. So we can start getting planks. And then that is going to take a ridiculous amount of logs. We will also need some stairs, which we can now unlock. Something like, nope, 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 nope. Something like this. Now, I wonder if they're going to be able to get to that. I hope they can. Let's take a look at how far that goes. Ah, uh, we haven't built that yet. Alright, how long is it? 8.6 days. 8.6 days. You know what? We might be able to survive it. We've got a lot of food. It's just the water I'm worried about. I may need to make another water tank. Just to be on the safe side. 
well, for the next drought. This drought is a bit too late. I would like to... I haven't got cogs. Yeah, that large water tank is going to take a bit of time before we can get that working. At least this dies out in nine days, so this should last the drought, thankfully. Clean up this area, that's fine. Okay, while the drought is on, you can be paused. You can go, where are you going? Carrying nothing works at farmhouse. Oh, did someone die? Died of old age, okay, cool. Okay, I'm glad I paused that. Okay, so the drought is about to pass. It's 0, 0.0 days until the drought is done. We had 17 water left and we still had tons of food. So we were fine. I had to turn these off because I didn't want to use up too much food there. Let's put all this back into action. Um, what do we need? We need you. We need you. We need you. We need to clear out all that stuff. We need to reduce this now. So we got no wood. <laughs> so hopefully the next drought is not too long. I've put nine days wood here and that would die soon. And I've put the 12 days wood here. The 24 days is just gonna take far too long. We've started making this bad boy and that's gonna go all the way along there and help us out. We've got pathways here, which I may just continue to make pathways and take these away eventually because we would want to block off somewhere else maybe here the shortest path and here somewhere so we can keep the water to ourselves we, we don't want it escaping now all of this needs to be replanted um i don't know if it will replant it itself because these are the original ones the ones i put i think they actually get replanted and we're getting trees ah oh, you know what i think we are actually stable depend on um how the next drought is it could be like a 30 day drought that's the thing if it's a 30 day drought then we're kind of screwed <laughs> then we're kind of screwed but if it's not we should be not too bad to be honest with you Let's get some people getting born. We're getting science. Let's um, research stuff. What do we need? Now, I want to decide between the double platform or a floodgate. I could use the dam for now. Dams for now are not too bad. I would like to put some floodgates there though. You know what, I'm just gonna put dams. I'm just gonna put dams for now. I would rather these double platforms so we can start stacking on top of each other. All right, let's do that. And you know what, I'm gonna stop research for a bit because I'm trying to think of what I need urgently. And until we actually get a dam going and getting water, constantly staying here or a lot longer to last us through bigger droughts i think i need them off research and doing something else we've got farmers we've got him planting there's no water here we might need to make a homemade um irrigation tower that might be a thing right now. But yeah, we can we can deal with that. Like as long as we're getting these trees, and as long as there's not another drought for a few days, we should be pretty much fine. Um We're not overpopulating, which is great. We're getting a lot of water in. Yeah, we just we literally just need to wait for wood to grow. And then we can start building all of this out. Now, I'm not sure if they're going to be able to make it that far. I really hope they can. I really, really hope they can. But that is a lot of wood. That's hundreds of wood. 
That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, like twenty-six at least, or twenty-five times oh, twelve. <laughs> That's a lot of wood, so we're gonna be needing to sort this out quite quickly. What another no way is there another drought. The things won't even survive that long. <laughs> I'm actually speechless at the moment. That's far too many droughts in one go. Oh man. I don't know if we're gonna... Su like, this is so brutal. This is so brutal. But... We're going to have to see if we survive in the next episode. So guys, thank you very much. Hopefully we've become stable. Hopefully everything's a lot better now. And we can carry on expanding this colony. I hope to see you guys on the next one. Peace.